Hi, Brent Tech here, where tech is made simple. So, with the release of Microsoft Edge version 123 near the end of March this year, as I posted, something it did was automatically install Copilot, which was a little small little app that you can find in your apps and features list. So, just a quick recap, because I will leave that video in the end screen on Windows 10 and Windows 11. If you head to your settings, apps, installed apps, and we scroll down just a little bit on some devices. This app, Microsoft Copilot, which is very small, it's 8 kilobytes in size, was being installed kind of without any knowledge and under the hood, so to speak. And as I also posted, it became uninstallable. So you couldn't uninstall the um, app on Windows 11, whereas on Windows 10, you can uninstall this little app. And at this stage, it's doing nothing. Now, just to let you know now that Microsoft has actually um, announced on their known issues, health, known issues Health dashboard page, they have now confirmed that this is a bug and is basically a harmless app. And if we just head over to that post, yeah, we can see Edge updates might cause Microsoft Copilot app to show up in installed apps. And Microsoft says updates to Edge browser, as mentioned, version 123, 2420.65 released on 28 March 2024 and later. So that's when this app was installed. Might incorrectly install a new package called Microsoft Chat Provider for Copilot in Windows on Windows devices. Resulting from this, the Microsoft Copilot app might appear in the installed apps in settings menu. They also mentioned it is important to note that the Microsoft Chat Provider for Copilot in Windows does not execute any code or process and does not acquire, analyze, or transmit device or environment data in any capacity. So that's according to Microsoft, but obviously that's open to debate. Now they carry on to say this package is intended to prepare some Windows devices for future Windows Copilot enablement and is not intended for all devices. Now that's what I originally thought that, um, like Microsoft is stating here, that it is intended to prepare some Windows devices for future Windows Copilot enablement. And then moving on, although the component installed as part of this issue can cause the Microsoft Copilot app to be shown as part of the installed apps, this component does not fully install or enable Microsoft Copilot. So if you were wondering that's um, that it does install Copilot, it does not according to Microsoft. They mention here in the next paragraph, as part of the upcoming resolution of this issue, the chat provider for Copilot in Windows component will be removed from devices where Microsoft Copilot is not intended to be enabled or installed. This includes most Windows Server devices because there's been a lot of issues with Windows Server where they are asking why do we need Copilot and obviously that now also includes Windows Server where it will be removed from server devices. And the next step, they say they are working on a resolution and will provide an update in an upcoming release of Microsoft Edge. So hopefully with Edge version 124, which should be rolling out um, soon, later this week, that should be removed if your device is not intended to receive Copilot. And the affected platforms here, we have Windows 11 and Windows 10 22H2. So... Just thought I'd put it out there because obviously that those little Copilot apps in the installed apps and features list have been causing quite a bit of concern and debate. So as mentioned, Microsoft has now confirmed that it's a bug and basically is harmless according to Microsoft. So thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next one.